this walkthrough guide is going to cover um, progression from black hole to big crunch, which is probably the easiest of the stages. Um, once you've reached this point, um, you just start consuming anything and everything in your path. And the one caution you have to watch out for is other black holes that are actually larger than you. And they'll be noted on the screen by a red icon or arrow pointing in the direction of that black hole. And basically you just want to stay as far away from them as possible. So don't even uh, get close enough to the point where you can see them. Because uh, if you can see that other black hole with it being larger than you, there's a good chance it's going to consume you. Uh, so because its gravitational pull is so strong, along with your gravitational pull, um, bringing it towards you as well. Um, probably the quickest way um, to progress through this stage is to consume other black holes as often as possible. And um, you can work on spawning additional black holes actually by uh, flinging around the dark matter asteroids that you see um, instead of just consuming them straight, over, straight up. Uh, if you can make them collide into something else, then they'll turn into black holes themselves and then you can consume those for much, much more mass. Um, next down the list is probably the stars, um, since there would be the most dense of everything else. And this is definitely part of the most laid back part of the game. star systems and make them fly into the place. Now you go back to being an asteroid again. And uh, I'll start posting um, videos showing how to get the various achievements that aren't um, attained through the videos themselves, um, like normal progression wise, any type of special uh, tricks that you might need to do for those.